everyone, my name is Agbaje Onome. Welcome to another show on Nebo TV. I'm so happy to have us once again on this channel. I hope we are all doing great from wherever we are right now. Alright, today I'm going to talk about the Lekki Toolkit massacre that took place in October 28th, 2020. And there is a new development as regards the massacre. The former presidential candidate of the African Action Congress, AAC, Moyele Shawari, has announced plans to lead a protest to Lekki Toolgate. This is following the approval from the reopening of Lekki Toolgate. We recall that Lekki Toolgate was shut down after several persons were gone down on October 20, 2020 by some persons believed to be soldiers during the NSAS protest in Lagos State. However, the toll gate is set to be reopened as the Lagos Judicial Panel probing the alleged killing of Ansas protesters returned control to its owner, the Lekki Concession Company. But Showaray on his Twitter page joined some Nigerians in kicking against its reopening. Showaray insisted that the toll gate remained shut until those behind the murder of those Nigerians be brought to book. First of all, on what basis are they going to open the plaza? The culprits are yet to be found. So many persons were accused, but they later denied the allegations. First, it was Tinibu and his son, Shei Tinibu, and then the CCTV revealed that it was the military that were behind the massacre. And the allegation is still yet to be proved by the court if it was actually the military or not. And now they are planning on reopening. We all know the truth about this country that once the toll gate is reopened, the massacre case will automatically be forgotten. So do they want the lives of those innocent citizens go to waste without justice? Well, according to Showari, he said he would lead a massive protest at the toll gate on Saturday, February 13, because justice must be served. But before I end the show today, I would love to ask us this question. Do we think that the toll gate will actually be reopened and what is the rate at which the youths will support Showare for the protest if it eventually leads one, looking at the rate at which innocent lives were affected during the last protest and till now no justice has been served? So please drop your comment in the comment section below as we wrap up now. Don't forget to subscribe to Nebo TV channel and click the notification bell to always get first hand updates from Nebo TV. And don't forget to follow us on our Instagram page at Nebo TV and our Facebook page at Nebo Telly. My name remains Agbaje Onome. Stay safe. God bless you and God bless Nigeria.